Hi, this is Kalia and is Hour, and you can tell by the title that this is all about my piercings video. Um, I will do all about my tattoos piercings later, but I have like a whole lot of piercings and this video will get long if I do piercings and tattoos. <laughs> okay, so I'm going to go with my first piercing up into my recent piercings. Okay, so as y'all know, first piercings are, of course, my bottom ones. Um... I want to say I was a child. Of course I was a child. But a lot of people like get theirs when they're a baby. I don't think I got my ears pierced as a baby. I think I was like a kid. Like four or five. I don't know. I don't know. I don't. I think so. Um, And then that was it for a while. Probably high school. My freshman year. Or sophomore. Freshman year. Freshman year I just was just in love with piercings. Like me and my sister got a love of piercings. But I have like way more than her. But, um, so, I want to say, like, all of these, I did not get them all at the same time. I didn't get them all at the same time, but I got them all within a year, you know, all in one year. Okay, so, I started from the bottom up. Okay, so, I got, like, these two done. And then a few months later, I got these two done. A few months later, these two done. Now, my trigus I got done my sophomore year. I waited for that one. So, I had all those. Um, and then, sophomore year is when I got this. Now, of all my piercings, this comes second. <laughs> I'm going to tell you my first, but this comes second. These just took a while to heal, and I don't know why. I don't know if it's because it's cartilage, and it just took a while, but it was painful, like, sleeping on it, and I got them both done at the same time, of course. So, like, it was hard to sleep. So, um, I got those, and then that was a while. That was it for a while. Um, senior year? No. Then I got my nose. So, sophomore year, I got my nose. Sophomore year, I got all these done, and then my nose. And then, we're moving on to my senior year is when I end up getting my, um, what's it? No, my nose sophomore year, my eyebrow, because I was 18, so I was able to go get that myself. Um, I went and got this one done. Now, this is number one. This hurt it like a, like, I don't know why, though, like. I don't know, but, um, I think it's because she's like, all right, count to three. So, I was like, in my head, one, two, three. Then she pierced it, but I know normal people, they're like, all right, count to three, and then on two, they do it. So, I think I was expecting it, and it didn't happen, and then I was cool, and then it happened. So, that's probably why I heard it more. It's more of a mental thing. Um, then I was, um, good for a while. Maybe end of my senior year, I got my tongue pierced. And the middle one. Ew. I had that one done when I was 18. Yeah, I have so many fears. I'm trying to think. And then after that one, I got my trigus done. Now, I got this one done and this one done at the same time. But this one, if y'all can see, it's a little split in there. It migrated. Now, let me, I, I'm going to talk about migration later because a hell of a lot of my piercings have migrated. And I just summed it up to clear. You just can't have surface piercings. I can't. Um, this one tried to, but I just legit just left it alone. Like, I, I didn't get my eyebrows done for a while. I just left it alone, and now it's fine. Um, and then I just got these done. Um, December 23rd, so I just got those done, and then last Friday was the 1st, yep, January 1st, I got this done, my smiley, now, um, it didn't hurt at all, like, of all my piercings, this hurt it the most, then these hurt it, and then those hurt it, um, it didn't hurt getting it pierced, but just healing was just like healing was horrible I mean that's the only thing about tongue piercings is the healing process your tongue gets swollen like a whale and it was just horrible can't really eat certain foods it was bad so total I think I'm sitting at 23 23 let's count 1 2 
3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23. 23 piercings. Um, I don't have anything below the neck down. No, I don't. I did, so let's get into migration. So, um... I had all four sides of my belly button pierced. Um, I wish I had, I used to have a picture, but I cannot find it nowhere, and I'm so pissed. But like, just say this, this is your belly button right here. I have one here, one here, one here, and one here. Um, they all migrated. And I keloid bad, so I will insert a picture now. So, did y'all see how bad that looks? Like, I mean, it's not as bad as it used to look, but it's still bad. So, I'm thinking about getting a belly button tattoo. I go to Miami in a few months. So, I don't know if I want to get a belly button tattoo over that. But, um, I also have my wrist pierced. I'll insert a picture. Cute. I don't know why I got that done. I just thought it was cute. But of course, it left. It looks crooked like this, but it wasn't crooked. Um, so I had that pierced. Just imagine my wrist looking like this. Okay, I can't do it. Alright, so I have my wrist pierced right here. You see a little scar. And I had it pierced over here. That's a burn, if y'all can see. Like, that's why I look like it. It's a little burn. But, you see, the keloid, I mean, it doesn't look bad, but it does. It's just like I got a cut somewhere. Like, when I tell y'all I keloid bad, I legit keloid bad. So, yeah, I have, like, keloids on my ears. From where my ear, like, right there. My ear tried, tried to reject my earrings, but they didn't. Um, I actually had one split right here, if y'all can see that. It actually split. Um, where else? I think that's it that they, um, migrated. So, yeah, I just summed it up. I can't get, um, surface piercings. But, um, y'all, that's pretty much it. Those are all about my piercings. Um, if you have any questions about them, leave them down below, and I'll answer them to my best ability. See you on my next video. Bye.